he's showing you a survival sheet. So it's four by 11 crisp packets. So joining your crisp packets up like this in fours. And then we're gonna add all these together to make 11. Okay, so I'm joining them in the middle of each one and then bringing it to the right, to the left with your baking paper and obviously your iron. you've done it all just check for holes and then just cut a little bit of plastic place it on your hole and fuse it down it's that simple starting to fuse nicely now the reason we fuse try and fuse it all like this is because if you if it gets cool then it'll rip but if it's fused onto the crisp packet it's less likely that it's going to get caught on anything like that really nice if you get or you could do it before you fuse your plastic is to write on the silver side of your crisp packet with a permanent marker just a nice little note of uh you know just to uplift these less fortunate um people in your community but made with love uh from the crisp packet project um but some of my volunteers write little messages right the way around don't want it too big okay this is where it's fused. Fairly neat. Beautiful. A little bit there I need to fuse. I'll come back to that in a sec. And there's a little bit along here somewhere. Let me just fuse that down. There we go. There's a survival sheet. All ready for the streets and safe. Put a lovely little note on it. Um, these can be folded up quite small, um, again, have a little work with it, get it smaller and smaller as you go, but um, they're pretty quick at getting really small. <laughs> 